I'm a single Jean and, and I'm a, uh, myself uh, owner and restaurant owner uh, in Belgium and the name is Air du Temps. Uh, we gained uh, two star Michelin star last year um, and uh, uh, it's really it's not really easy to describe uh, our our cuisine style but we have uh, we are totally open and we really like to discover new thing to uh, to meet people and I think it's a it's a, a good and a really good way to discover and to create new dish. The food pairing is based on the uh, chemical analysis uh, between around components of food. Um, you can have um, main flavor in common, and when you have main flavor in common, you can have a good combination, a good dish, and you can marry um, kiwi and oyster. You can marry carrots and violet because you have common flavor. You can marry to a, a jasmine and a foie gras. It's really, really good. And I think it's a good way to create new dish now. And it can influence a lot of, a lot of a new generation of chef. You have two cases. The first one is um, you keep all chemical analy analysis from your, your chemist or scientist. Or you discover yourself. You smell one thing and one thing, and you do, oh, I think kiwi and oyster is good for me. And I send a mail to my scientist, and I say, kiwi and oyster, can you analyze this for me? And he said to me, okay, fine, you have 14 common flavor. It's crazy, and I think it's a, it's a second way to create new dish around food pairing. You, you don't have basic elements. All element is a, um, a good source of inspiration. And uh, at, at the moment, we have a site we call foodpairing.be, and you can find maybe 150 different elements who, um, who were analyzed. And you can have a new, um, a new tools to create with that. I think uh, food pairing it's one way to create, but you have so many ways to find now at the moment in the, in the actual uh, case of food, uh, in the new generation of cooker, you, uh, you are influenced by all the things. And technology are one of the things, I think so. And food pairing, it's a good way to have a classical dish too, I think. <laughs> I have to... Um, to explain the the genesis of the of my of my job, I'm not I'm not chef. I never learned to cook. I'm sommelier. And I, when I begin to cook, I said I need to know how all the things are set in a kitchen. Transformation, molecular transformation, chemical, physical. I need all these things. And after this, it's really a new, a new way for me. I need to know. And when I know, I can create. And I create a lot of things. So many things, more things. Be, be totally mind open. That's, that's the way. Uh, you have to try. Uh, if maybe so crazy thing you, you think, you have to try. And after, okay. You try, it's not good, okay, but you try. It's the it's main thing, I think. <laughs>